Hey guys, I'm back with another huge, huge, huge SAS info video for you guys. I have a ton of reviews on a bunch of scents that are kind of going to come back. Pretty much, I have all the tea. I have all the scents that are coming back for SAS. All the candles, collection, and every scent name, everything I'm going to be doing, like a bunch of reviews on certain products. Sneak Peek, Cherry Blossom is back, but obviously it always is. <laughs> and I'm going to show you what I have from, the collect from my collection that is going to come back. Uh, I'll read you the keynotes, everything, talk about my, do little mini reviews on everything for you guys, and share with you guys every everything. So I have everything here for you guys up to this day of filming. So, plus I have tea on the soaps that are out this week, coupons that are starting to come out in stores this week for SAS, and a whole lot more. So you know the deal. Like up this video, comment, subscribe, great bell, and um, all my other social media will be there, down below, of course, like always. Show this from Route 21, woo! Hey, 30% off sale, okay. <laughs> um, let's just get right into it, you guys. Um, so starting today, you can go to Bath and Body Works and get your 10 off 40 coupons. They're going to be giving you um, that with your purchases starting today. So you can start collecting your coupons. Just go to Bath and Body Works and do your uh, purchases and you will get that SAS coupon. Um, yeah, and the perfect time to go is now because they have those new soaps starting today, which the new soaps are... Oh, this is all courtesy of Tess, Bath and Body Works Daily Finds on Facebook and Instagram. Got a shout out always. Um, Okay, Daily Finds, yeah, okay. So this new uh, soap collection is called Going Places. It's out today. Uh, it should be out right now. Um, it's definitely online, but uh, yeah. I think it should be in stores too. I know it's online for sure May 4th, which this is gonna be. Okay, so I think, it's, I think it should be in store this week. Because it was online on Saturday, May 4th, and today's May 6th, because I'm going to put this up tonight. So, yeah. Anyway, we're going to get to it, you guys. So, Going Places Hands Up Collection. If it's not out now, it'll be out very soon. Uh, first one's called Paris. Spoiler alert, it's a repackage of Rosewater and Ivy. Keynotes are a fresh cut bouquet of soft rose petals, rain kissed ivy, and spring musk. And this is what the packaging looks like. Oh, I can't widen it? Okay, well. <laughs> this is the picture of it. Sorry, I can't widen it. I can't enlarge it. Can I enlarge it? Oh, yes, I can. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this is what the packaging looks like. It just looks like Paris. Let's see, there's a glare there. Oh, there we go. Okay. It's pretty, but just rose white and ivy. Packaging is decent, I will say that. Um, okay, well, it exits out every time I do that. Lovely. Okay, next one is California, which is Endless Weekend repackaged. A fresh floral fusion of white hydrangea, violet blossoms, and sparkling citrus. And um, that packaging looks like this. Okay. <laughs> Okay, um, I'm not gonna do. I'm not buying anything until SAS. So these will be three dollars in a month. So I'm not gonna bother with these. Especially these aren't even near. They're just free packages. So yeah, I'm not gonna rush to the store. But if you want to get these and get that coupon to get extra coupons for ten off forty, go ahead. Okay, New York City, and that's a repackaged champagne toast. Uh, a cheers worthy spritzer of bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and juicy man uh, tangerine. And that packaging looks like this. These are online right now and should be in store soon if they're not already. And you can call your store and see ahead of time before going in and see if these are there yet. Um, yeah, but these are going to be on sale for SAS, so you can just wait a month. These aren't even anything that special in my opinion. Packaging is cute, but it's just repackages, so. Okay, then there's London, which is white tea and sage, an earthy blend of fresh tea, lemon, and herbs. Um, and that's going to be the London one. So that's the packaging of that. This thing is really cute. The Big Ben. It's really cute. So, yeah. That's really cute. And then the last one from this collection is... 
Hawaii, which is coconut colada, a cool frothy cocktail of creamy coconut, frozen lemon, and vanilla musk. Uh, and then coming soon, we'll be matching three weekend single wick candles that will match this soap collection as well coming soon. So yeah. And let me show you the packaging of the Hawaii one. So again, this is going to be matching single and three wick candles as well. That's going to match this collection coming soon as well. So that'd be nice. Something to hold this over until, you know, June, the SAS. If you haven't seen my last videos, then let me give you a quick little update. Uh, SAS starts June 10th, Monday, June 10th, obviously a day before online, Sunday 9th online. And then it ends uh, Sunday, July 7th, f four weeks. Yep, four weeks. Monday, June 7th, wow. Monday, June 10th. <laughs> I was thinking July 7th. Monday, June 10th, it starts, and it, SAS, and it ends um, Sunday, July 7th. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, a mess. Okay, so that's the soap collection. Again, it's called Going uh, Going Places. Okay, so that should be out in stores now. If not, it should be out soon, with matching candles to come soon. Single and three wick. Um, okay. There's a new Kenna collection out right now also, and that one is called New Seas, the Kenna collection, with Berry Waffle Cone. Um, that is online already. It should be out now, and, um, yeah, so, and that should be in stores as well. If it isn't, it will be soon, and that's going to come out with all this stuff. So, this is going to be a long video, so get a snack, okay. And, um, sorry, get your pen and paper out, because we're going to start to write everything down because I'm going to start doing body care for SAS in a minute. Okay, um, berry waffle cone. Looks like that. I'm going to kind of rush through these. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this collection consists of Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. I'm not going to read all this stuff because it's going to be too much, but I'm just going to rush through this part because I know you really want to get to the SAS stuff, so I'm just going to rush through this. Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit, Berry Waffle Cone, Blue Ocean Waves, Coconut Sandalwood, Fresh Sea Walk, and this is now out now. This is not even SAS. Um, Island Papaya, Salted Ocean Air, The Perfect Summer, Tiki Beach, and if you go to her blog uh, on Facebook and Instagram as well, again, um, Bath and Body Works Daily Finds on Facebook and Instagram. You can read all the keynotes of all this and stuff and the pictures. I'll just zip through the pictures really quickly. So that one's the Tiki Beach. And then there is that one, which is the Island Papaya. Yeah. And then this one, which is the Perfect Summer. And then that one is, what is that one? Blue Ocean Waves. And then Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. So yeah, pretty collection. And then that one is coconut sandalwood and then fresh sea walk. That one's gorgeous, I love that packaging, oh my gosh. The last one is salted ocean air. So yeah, that should be there. So this is just gonna hold us over until SAS. Um, so yeah, for keynotes, you can go to her blog and see that, okay. <laughs> anyway, I think that's it for that. Now let's get to um, what, why you're here, which is the, the tea on what's coming up for SAS. Okay. Okay, let's get into it, you guys. I have a lot to get through. Okay. So, this is what 10 out 40 coupon looks like, in case you're wondering. So, we can pick up those in store starting today, and also, this should be in the mailer, in your mailing, coming in the mail in a few weeks. Usually, about a week or two before the sale, it starts coming into your mailbox. So, Okay, this is not everything, but this is probably, this is a lot of it that's coming out. Okay, let's start with body care and then we'll do candles. So this is body care. Let's start with retired fragrances. And these are all going to have new labels on them. And these are all going to be available, these are going to be available in Fine Fragrance Mist, Body Cream, Body Lotion, and Shower Gel. Ready? This first one is, I'm really excited about this one. This is SAS, what's going to come back? Body care. Black Raspberry Vanilla is back. I've never smelt it, and I've always wanted to smell it, and I can't wait to get it. Okay, hopefully multiples if I like it. Brown sugar and fig. Um, it's a good one, but I'm not going to be getting that one. But anyway, that's back. 
Butterfly flower, I like it. I'm gonna get maybe multiples of that when it comes out. Okay, now for cherry blossom. This is the one first one I have here. So, I have cherry blossom. So here's my review on this one. Excuse me. Uh, packaging is gorgeous. I have the shower just because I can read the keynotes and everything. Um, this one I discovered last summer, I say yes, and it was amazing. It smells like, kind of like cherry fruit juice. It smells so good. Almost like a cherry pop. Um, I'll just read the keynotes. Uh, dewy watermelon, red plum, cherry blossom, share freesia, and soft sandalwood. So this will be back. I recommend you get this. This is really good if you haven't already. If you aren't a fan of Japanese cherry blossom and you want something light and youthful, this will definitely be it for you. Cherry blossom. And if you're not, if you're not really a fan of floral, you'll like this anyway. It smells like watermelon, plum, and cherry. It smells really good. So that's back. Also, everyone's favorite from the 90s, cucumber melon is back. This is the shower gel. These are all showers I want to show you, except one spray coming up. Cucumber melon, and these are, maybe, these are all have new packaging, so it should be new. It says, it says new label, so I'm guessing these are going to be old, I guess. So that'll be kind of fun. Uh, keynotes are crisp cucumber, watery honeydew, summer cantaloupe, sparkling grapefruits, sheer woods. I probably won't get any more of these because I have plenty of these. Um, the only one that I'm going to get that I read out is the black, cherry van black raspberry vanilla, if I like it. The butterfly flower, so far. Oh, this just reminds me of middle school, really. Everyone's in the 90s. This was the go-to. Even I, I remember using this in elementary school as well. Like the late 90s. I would, maybe even mid-90s I used to use. Oh, it's just so youthful and fabulous and fresh. This is the best summer scent. Oh, my God. Cucumber melon. So good. Okay. Enough of that. Um, okay, Dark Kiss. It's back. This SAS, if you want to stock up, go ahead. The key notes are black raspberry, uh, burgundy rose, bergamot incense, dark vanilla bean, and plum musk. I have a question. Does black raspberry vanilla smell like dark kiss? Let me know in the comments below because I've never smelled black, black raspberry vanilla and I really want to see if I like that. You see, dark kiss is very hit and miss for me. I like it but I'm not like in love with it. But I do like it. I don't know. It smells good today, so. <laughs> Dark Kiss. Okay. That's back. I won't be getting any more of that, but it's back. Mango Mandarin is back. Okay. Keynotes are Juicy Mango, Sparkling Mandarin, Orange, and Nectarine, Nectarine Blossom. Just really nice and fruity. You smell the mango and you smell the nectarine. It's really nice for summer. Um, glad they're bringing it back. I don't need any more of this myself, but it does smell good. So I think it's the best in the shower gel. Mango mandarin. Okay, pink cashmere is back. I'm not a fan of pink cashmere. Um, I don't even have it. Um, I did, I gave it away. It's just, um, it's very unforgettable. It's very light. It's very boring, in my opinion. But uh, I don't know. It's back, so I know some people love it. So, cracking my knuckles. Um, so that's back. If you like that, and then sun ripened raspberry. I used to have that. I couldn't find it, so I guess I gave it away. Um, I like uh, sun ripened raspberry, but you know I had to just give things away because I'm buying so much and not using as much as I'm buying. Um, I am using a lot of stuff up, though. I have another empties coming up soon, you guys. I, I've been using a ton of stuff up, you guys. A ton of stuff. I'm gonna do a, one more S, uh, one more SAS, one more uh, empties before the before SAS. So and maybe in a few weeks, maybe before that, honestly, because I'm using a lot of stuff up. So definitely another uh, empties. If you haven't seen the last empties I did last week, go check that out as well. That was another big one as well. Um, but sun up and raspberry, I had to give it away. Um, I like it. It smells like sunscreen and it smells like raspberries, but it's nice. But I won't be getting more of it. But it's this nice one. I like that one. Okay, guys, next color. Okay, so that one's just the retired fragrances. Okay, new labels. The next one is going to be designed for sale, and it's uh, new labels on these as well, and it comes in all forms. Fine fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel. First one's apple blossom. I'm guessing it's going to be this in, an, in a new label, and this, this was out last year, 
and uh, apple blossom lavender. I'm guessing it's maybe going to be this repackaged or maybe without the lavender. So it's going to probably be something like this repackaged in my opinion. Um, this smells really good. I wouldn't get any more of this, but I like it. Keynotes are a hand-picked bouquet of apple blossoms, fresh-cut lavender, and jasmine petals dot, dotted with passion fruit and sparkling quince. See, I love passion fruit. That's why I like it so much. I'm a big passion fruit fan and apple fan. So there you go. Okay. Clementine and mint leaf. I don't know what that is. Is that a repack? You can let me know. I don't think so. Maybe it is. I don't have it. It might be new. I don't know. Lavender and cotton flower. That looks interesting to me. I think that looks, that's new to me at least. Probably more lavender. I'm guessing it's going to be like maybe like a sea cotton and sea cotton or la uh, cotton blossom mixed with like lavender. Sounds good to me. I'll probably get one for like a room spray or something. Oh, I don't know why I'm showing this again. <laughs> oh, because there's lavender in it. Okay. But I was like, why am I showing this again? Um, and then wild strawberry. Okay. This is probably going to be... The wild strawberry leaf repackaged from last year, which is repackaged the bourbon strawberry vanilla from like every year. What is it with that uh, strawberry bourbon and vanilla that they have to either bring it back and repackage it every SAS? You know what sucks? I used to like that scent and now they've done it so many times and I'm over it. Because it's like I have to give it all away. I don't have it to show you because it's just so repackaged. It smells like a nice, it smells like a, like a strawberry and cream lifesaver, but it just, it just, it's so hard to give it away. They ruined a good thing, they just keep bringing it back too many times. Okay, but that's going to be probably the repackage of that. Okay, next one is going to be called Summer Cocktails, next collection. Available in all, all these forms, fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel. First one is Fresh Coconut Colada, this is going to be exactly like last year, and it's a, it says no new label, so it'll be the exact same label, and this is what it'll be like probably, last year's label again. Fresh Coconut Colada, I never even used this, I need to get on that by the way. Uh, keynotes are a splash of coconut milk, a dash of vanilla rum, topped with pink hibiscus. I probably should have brought the other thing that this is a repackage of. But the um, Poolside Coconut Colada from 2016 is a repackage of this 100%. Like that's, this is a repackage of that and then this is going to be the same as, the one this year is going to be, this, they're bringing this back again, probably the same packaging. Smells good. That was loud. It smells good. It smells good. I need to use it, but whatever. It does smell good, though. It smells like a pina colada. So if you want this, it's back so you can hoard it if you want. <laughs> okay. Uh, grapefruit Breeze. Ugh, I know. That lemon one, lemon and raspberry, but not lemon one that they bring back too many times. It smells like sour Skittles. I liked it, but they've done it too many times. I'm over it now. Um, Yeah. And then watermelon lemonade. Personally, I'm over that scent. I just, I can't anymore. I just, it's gross in every form except for the soap. I, I, I hate it in the pocket bag. I hate it in the spray. Don't like it in the cream. Don't like it in the, um, I like it in the candle. That's about it. And even that's wearing thin. Like, the soap is great in it, but I have plenty of that. Um, ugh, can't stand it in the, in the spray or the shower gel. It's wor hor it, it's supposed to cap is in the shower gel, so I can't do that. And then the cream, ooh, no. Anyway, so, but it, you, I know a lot of you guys like it, so it's back for you guys to hoard. What I'm eliminating, that, that always comes back. It's kind of getting tired. It's been tired, but it's back, so if you want to watch that, if you want to watch that, if you want to get that, get that. Um, I don't have it, so I give it all away, except the soap, but... I guess I could have, I should have bought the soap to give you the pack. It's just, it's just lemon and watermelon, that's, the, yeah. <laughs> that's the keynotes. Okay. Now, the next collection coming out is Sun, Air, and Sky. This one is also really tired. They bring this back every time, but whatever. Available in the mist, the body cream, lotion, and shower gel. Golden Magnolia Sun. I don't have it because I gave it away. It smells nice, so you can smell it when you when it comes out. If you're new to Bath & Body Works, it'll be exciting. If you're not, it's, you're going to roll your eyes and pass by the, the bin when you see it. I love my little shade. It's funny. It's true, though. Uh, Pear Blossom Air. Okay, I have that one. I did keep that one. Is the packaging for this shower gel? Okay, keynotes are crisp green, green, green pear, fresh gardenia. Okay, this says narcissus leaf, and I always want to say narcissist. <laughs> ah! 
Amas Narcissus leaf, whatever the hell it is, with whispers of crisp mandarin vapor and white musk. Okay, girl. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Just from the gardenia and pear. So I like it. Yeah. Anyway, this is back. I'm not gonna be getting it. This is, I have plenty of this as well. So. But if you want to get this, go ahead. Yeah, it's back. And then Violet Lily, Violet Lily Sky. I couldn't find it. Maybe I have it. I don't remember if I have it or not. Um, I think I gave it away as well. It smells really good, but it's back. Oh, it's always back, so whatever. If you want to get it, it's there. Okay, now the next collection is called Best of Summer. And available again in the mist, cream, lotion, and shower gel. Beach water coconut. This is going to be exact same as last year. Same packaging as well. This is the shower gel. Um, I ended up really liking the shower gel. It smells kind of like a, um, well, let's get to it in a minute. Okay, uh, keynotes are creamy coconut milk, sparkling bergamot, bamboo leaves, and saltwater mask. It smells nice, but then it smells even better when you're using it in the shower. Oh my god, okay. It kind of smells like the inside of a Hollister. Not an Abercrombie, but like a Hollister. This was like a hot Hollister model, but like not heavy, like a light scent. Like it's not like, oh, like, you know, it's, it's like a nice, like a Hollister model, just oh, okay. like a Hollister model, just took a shower. There we go. Yeah. Will I get more of this? Probably not, but it's nice. Okay. Obviously everything that I have, obviously I like it enough to keep it. So there you go. But I won't get any more of that. Okay, so uh, at the end, I'll tell you what I'm going to be getting and what I won't be, okay? At the, end, at the end of the video, okay? At the end of this little list thing for the body care. Um, what else? Okay. Uh, seaside. Seaside. Sea salt. What's seaside? What a mess. Seaside breeze. Li live fresh. Why is that so hard to say? Okay. This originally came out in 2016. Summer, uh, July 2016. <clears throat> um... This is a good one. The packaging is gorgeous. Um, here are the keynotes. <clears throat> As my throat starts to dry up. Um, coconut water, juicy nectarin, beach, I almost said beach bum. <laughs> beach blossoms, fresh air, sun-kissed musk. Okay. Bubble. Ooh, this is really nice. Aw, bubble. <laughs> Yeah, this one's really good. Yeah, this one's just summer to me in a bottle. Mmm, that one's really good. It's like clean but sweet and also beachy. Mm. Anyway, I don't need any more of this, but so I have it. I'm gonna try to use as much of this as I can this summer, but I don't know. I like it though. As my nose itches. Oh, okay, all the scents all at once. Uh, next one is Sunset Guava Colada. That's back. Obviously, this is all gonna come back. This whole point of the video. Love this packaging. This is a great one. This is one of the best ones from the summer line um, last summer. Love. I love anything with a sunset on it. I think it's so gorgeous. Keynotes are sun-kissed guava, pink passion fruit. I like passion fruit. Wild orchid and sugared coconut. And I like coconut that's sugared. So. Ooh, it smells so good. It smells like you're swimming with the dolphins in Hawaii. It smells so good. Oh, I love this one. Yeah, this one's really good. I, I probably won't get any more of this because, let's be honest, I've used this much in a year, so I don't need any more of this already. <laughs> but it's good. It's good. So I'm glad they're bringing it back for you guys. If you haven't gotten this, get it, though. It's really good. Sunset Guava Colada. Cute name, too. Okay. And then, of course, this is always back. Every, I don't even know, I don't know. They should just have this year round in the store because they bring it back every time. Beach Night Summer Marshmallow. I know, everyone's going to cheer. Oh my god, I love it! I love this. But it's kind of gets to the point now in which, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's great, it's a classic, it's iconic, it's great, but it's like, okay, enough already, you know? It's like, we get it. You know, I was like, why do you have to bring it back? I mean, I guess it's so popular to always bring it back. It's good, but... I don't know. I haven't used it in a while. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. 
I like it. It's great. Packaging is iconic AF, but just they always bring it back. It's like, okay, okay, you know? I think that distance makes the heart grow fonder, when a heart grows fonder, heart grow fonder or whatever, and it's like, maybe we would like it more if it wasn't there for a few years, then come back. And you guys are like, no, I want it back. Ah, just get it now, and then you don't have to get it back. <laughs> well, I'm just kidding, okay, whatever. Anyway, it's back for everybody who wants it. Everyone always wants me this. Once it's back, so it's back. It's always back. Anyway, what's the point? Anyway, did I read the keynotes? I forgot, whatever. Toasted marshmallow, sea salt breeze, s'mores accord, beach strip with creamy vanilla. When this first came out three years ago, I was like gagging over it, but now I'm like, okay, enough with it. I don't know. It is good. I don't know, but. And then we have all those repackages of it too, like the vanilla bean and the. Why well, I'm like a kiss from 2D Dolce. Like, it's all the same. It's very similar to this. So it's like. Kind of cheapens it, but I know, this is the original. In case you're wondering, like before Wild Milk had Kiss and all that vanilla bean, all that stuff, this was the OG baby. This is the one that made all the friends. This is what's the Bath and Butter was kept repackaging. <laughs> this is the one that's always repackaged. This is the one. In case you're wondering, the famous Beach Nights original packaging too. Yeah, this is really good though. I don't know. Anyway, enough of that. Okay, so that's back. Now the next collection, and I'm, oh my god, there's one of the scents I'm gonna go, go crazy, crazy over, okay. Best of Celebrate, of course, in all forms, is back in Fragrance Mist, Body Cream, Lotion, and Gel, Shower Gel, Champagne Toast for the millionth time. I love it in the Shower Gel only. This is the original packaging that came out in 2016. Keynotes are, and this is the best packaging there was, just saying. Last year's packaging was cute, but this was way better than last year's packaging. Oh my god. Okay. Pink Champagne, Black Currant Chambord, Sparkling Nectarine, and Sugared Musk. Okay. In the shower gel, it's everything. Oh my god, yes. Oh my god, oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. Oh, anyway, sorry, I need a little moment there to escape. Anyway, um... I swear you get high off this. I swear to God, I feel high right now. Ah, just smelling this. Um, okay, so I need a moment to put myself, put myself, get myself together. Champagne toast. So this is back. Um, I mean, it's always back. People love it. So if you don't have this or have used it already up in your collection, there you go. I get why this is back. It's great. It's great. Uh, I'm guessing it'll be back in probably the last year's packaging, not this packaging. <clears throat> but maybe, maybe you'll find some in this packaging, but it'll probably be back in last year's packaging. Probably have an overstock from last winter. I say it's gonna bring it back this year. It's pretty. Um, great packaging, and it's. Um, but like I said, it, don't, don't expect it in this package. It'll be not just packaging, right? <laughs> Cocktail dress. No, not for me. But a lot of people like it, so it's back. Pink mango spritzer. I liked it. I liked the idea of it, and then I ended up using it. Oh. They ruined it with that balsam. They have it's a strong balsam. The same thing they ruined. The same way, I, my ankle cracked, the same way they ruined that snowy morning with the heavy balsam last year, oh god, they ruined the, the pink mango spritzer, I would love it if they just lessened the balsam or took the balsam away completely and just, then it would have been everything. No, the pink mango spritzer is ruined by the balsam. Now if you love balsam, which I know some of you guys love balsam, well there you go, if you love balsam, get the pink mango spritzer, it is balsam up in your face all day every day. Okay, like a Christmas tree is literally in your house all year round and it's fresh. Okay, there you go. With a hint of that print mango. No, if you're a mango fan like me, it's not, it's barely mango. It's, it's balsam first and then like maybe like a drop of mango on the side. No, yeah, so no, not for me. But it's there for if you like it. The packaging's cute though. Now this next one, I could scream. I'm so excited for. Wrapped in sugar is finally coming back after three and a half years. Oh my God. I have waited three and a half years for this. Okay, a little middle mini story time, okay? Me and this freaking scent. It came out originally, end of 2016, remember this? And I smelt it a month beforehand, right? At my store, but they would let me buy it because it was they hadn't put it out yet. I was like, okay, I'll come back in a month and buy it. Then I, a few weeks later, I went by one of my little, one of my little like, one or two month no-buys that I always do, little breaks. I'm like, oh, I've been doing a no-buy for a while. It lasts a month or two, and then I come back. So it was one of those little things. And I didn't even go to, I, di I didn't shop in December. And I didn't shop at the Body Works. 
most of that January for SAS. And then the last week of the sale, I, I was like, oh, it'll be there, it'll be there. It was all sold out and everything. But then uh, that following summer, I ended up getting the champagne toast and everything else and, the, and everything else. But one thing I could never find from that collection that I wanted to try was Raps and Sugar because it smelled so good and I've always wanted it. Love the packaging. It was my favorite out of everything. I even liked it better than this, from what I remember. Champagne toast. Originally came on this packaging. And this one, the pink confetti, always comes back cocktail dress, but never that Raps and Sugar. And I keep requesting it, please. Finally, Raps and Sugar is back and I am going to... I've never even purchased it before. I've only smelled it once. So... I know it's itching right here. Okay. Anyway, um, so how many of this am, am, am I gonna get? I'm probably gonna get at least six sprays, six shower gels, and two creams. At least, maybe three creams. Probably three creams. I'll be honest. Three creams, six sprays, and six shower gels minimum in this. I'm gonna go ham on this wrapped in sugar. You're gonna see. Oh my god! So get ready for that. <laughs> when I read that wrapped in sugar is back, I almost fainted and passed out. And the packaging, hopefully it's original packaging. Pink and pretty, okay? Not ugly packaging, please. But even if it is ugly packaging, I don't care, I'm still gonna buy it. As long as it smells good. Okay. Uh, so, I'm like, oh my god. That and the black cherry black raspberry vanilla are the ones I'm really excited about trying. Okay. Yeah, anyway. And uh, whatever. Okay, next collection. Best of Tropical, it's called. All forms. It's gonna come back in fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel. Fresh sea salt mango. I don't know why this is such a big deal. Everyone loves this and it keeps coming back. I tried to give it a chance. That's heavy sea salt made me thirsty and it made me, ugh, I can't do that. But it's back. If you want it, it's there. I give it away. I don't have it here. Honolulu Sun. They keep bringing this back. I like it, but it's like, eh, yeah, whatever. Um, love the packaging. It is, I know Nicole No Fire, shout out to Nicole No Fire. I know she loves Honolulu Sun, girl. I like it. Um, so happy for Nicole, she has it back. I know she's gonna be stocking up in that girl. <laughs> right, Nicole? <laughs> and your little Honolulu, Honolulu Sun. <laughs> she loves Honolulu Sun, Nicole in the fire. Oh my god. Okay. Um love the blue packaging though. Um I don't know, I like it, but it's like I don't know, cut to me hauling it in a month. <laughs> hey guys, I got Honolulu Sun. I like it, but it's one of those things that like, okay, I'm not picking my nose. Okay, this is what's happening. Like, I'm gonna do it here so you don't think I'm picking my nose. Okay, I'm just scratching my nostril here. Okay, I'm not going in the nostril, I'm just doing this. Okay, so don't be like, you're picking your nose on camera. I mean, like, what I don't care, but I'm saying I'm not, okay? And if I did, I would just say so because I don't care. Ah, uh, mess, you guys. Um, so I don't have that to show you guys, but it's okay. I don't know, if, if I spray it on me, I might just get it, I don't know, for a mess, I know. Higher than white sand. <laughs> hate it with a passion, Island white, Island white sand. Hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. That's all I gotta say about that. <laughs> I'm just saying, I do. But that's back, I don't have it, as I hate it. Oahu Coconut Sunset, okay, this one's really good. This smells very similar to that uh, new uh, Victoria's Secret scent called Tropic Heat, except that has pineapple in it, and this doesn't. Does this have pineapple in it? No, but that has pineapple in it, which makes it even better. But this is pretty good, too. Um, Oahu Coconut Sunset, okay. Love this packaging. Keynotes are Coconut Blossom, Sparkling Bergamot, Beach Tuberose, Hawaiian Minoy, and Molten Amber. It's like a sugared, super sugared coconut smell. Oh my god, that's, it's, it does smell really good. It really smells good. So, I won't get any more of it because I'm over it, but it's good. I'm not over it, but I'm over it. I'm not, I don't need any more in it, okay. Okay, now let's do the men stuff. Hey, can we leave our men out, our sexy guns? Okay, men's body care for sale. What's gonna come back? Dark Amber is back, you guys. If you want more Dark Amber, the two-in-one hair and body wash for men, it's back, you guys. Get it for your sons, get it for your um, husbands, your boyfriends, your brothers, your uncles, your dads. Get it for all of them in your life. And if you're a woman who anyone wants to like a man, get it for yourself, too. I don't blame you, because I like women's scents, but I'm a man, and I... This stuff smells... I think this smells better than the women's shower gel, I'm just saying. Woo! 
girl. This smells like a sexy man. I mean, they all do, but... Oh, my God. Like a hot, hot, hot sexy guy with abs and pecs and muscles and... Oh, like a hot, hot model. Anyway, I'm gonna... Stop smelling this before I get into bad news in my mind. Um, my mouth's gonna get dirty in a minute, so I'm gonna move on. But this one's good. Okay, can you know the other keynotes of this? There are. Fresh bergamot, warm amber, and dark woods, you guys. Oh my god, this all smells like a hot man. Girl, yes! So I'm gonna move on before I get dirty, okay? <laughs> dark amber, love it. Loving for that. Um, next one, can I go about Paris for men? I don't know. When I smell that, I don't really, that, that isn't my thing. So I, I, I don't have that, but it's gonna come back. Suede is back. And then, ooh, am I spitting? I don't know. Uh, Mahogany Woods is back. I have that. Great packaging. This came back last winter, as they asked. It's alright. I mean, it's more than alright. It's good, but... Oh, I think I used it once. So you see, I used it once. <laughs> um, fresh Mahogany, Bourbon Vanilla, and Golden Amber. Oh, this smells so good. This smells like a hot guy. He's wearing a flannel shirt. He's been chopping wood. All night. Um, I'm, I, you know what? I know it's so easy for me to go there, but for once in my life, I'm not going to go there. He's been chopping wood outside all night. God, I want to go there so bad. Okay. He's been chopping wood all night. And then he comes home and he smells like he's been chopping wood all night. And I'm not going to go through the rest of that because you know me. Girl, all I gotta say is these men's scents get me feeling a certain way. That's all I gotta say. Okay, anyway, moving on. So that's back, the Mahogany Woods. And then last but not least for the men's stuff is the White Water Rush. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Okay, so, so the Dark Amber is only going to come back in lotion and shower gel. Oh, well, duh, they don't have sprays in these, do they? Okay. Lotion and shower gel for the Dark Amber. Only Paris for Men lotion and shower gel, suede shower gel and body cream, mahogany woods. Where is the mahogany woods? Mahogany woods is gonna come back in lotion and shower gel only, and then the white water rush. Love this packaging too. Is only gonna come out in shower gel and body lotion as well. Okay, let's do the keynotes for this. Fresh white water, aromatic bergamot, white cedar. Bubbles. Okay, that went in my mouth. Ew. Okay. <laughs> God, this smells so good. This kind of smells like maybe like an Abercrombie and Fitch store. Yeah. This is mahogany. Oh, this is mahogany. This. This smells like just like mahogany. I mean mahogany. This smells like Abercrombie and Fitch Fierce cologne. Exactly like it. Yeah, this smells good. Oh, this smells like an Abercrombie Fitch model, baby. Sexy model. Okay. Why would a rush? Smell, it, smell that. We'll smell it and get it. <laughs> On June 10th. Yeah, June 10th. It can That was loud. It cannot be. I wish it was June 10th now so I can go shopping and get more stuff I don't need, girl. Hoard more stuff. Okay. Um. Okay, now for the miscellaneous stuff. Okay. Assortment. Wild Berry and Heaven Meal is going to come back. I have it in this... In the... Spray, I know, hideous packaging. It's coming back in the fine fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel. Um, I sprayed this on earlier today just to see. I like it. Um, I don't need any more of it. I'm not gonna get more of it, but it's okay. Um, okay. Ugh, this hideous in the sun is back. I hate that smell. I think it smells gross. It smells like rotten sunscreen. Uh, it's coming back in the fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel. That's back, so enjoy that, because I ain't gonna have that. Lavender and sandalwood's back. <laughs> um, so that's good. It smells, smells really good. This is really, really good. It's gonna come back in the mist, cream, lotion, and shower gel. Oh, this one's so good. This is a good scent to... What's that flowing in the air? This is a good scent to, uh, to shower before bed. It's really, really good. Is there keynotes on this or no? Oh, okay. 
Aromatic blend of magnolia petal soft sandalwood and natural lavender oil. Yeah, just lavender and sandalwood. Just, it'll put you to sleep, so use it before bed. Or put it in your bubble bath before bed. Girl, yes. Use it, use it as like aromatherapy, it'll work. You know? uh, what else do we got? Rose quartz. Awful packaging. This is my little grab book, Rose quartz. Rose quartz. It smells just like the rose line. I should just bring that back. It's better packaging. Why bother with rose quartz? But anyway, it's coming back in fragrance mist, body cream, lotion, and shower gel, so enjoy it. So the packaging of the lotion is ugly as hell, but anyway, whatever. What's his name? Uh, and then the coconut milk body oils back, coconut milk body scrub, tear, manoil, manoil body oils back, and island sand body scrub is back. Okay, whatever. Anyway, now for the candles. Well, this is 40 minutes long. I told you it'll be long. Hopefully, have your snack. Okay. <laughs> um, next is the. Um, okay, I read the last part really quickly, but hopefully, you got that. Coconut mint. Coconut milk and the Terminoi and the Island Sand body scrub, body oil for the Terminoi. Terminoi, coconut milk body scrub, and coconut milk body oil. I said it twice because I said it kind of fast, so. Okay, now for the home fragrance and candles. Okay, ready for this? All you candle fanatics out there, get your pen and paper ready. Summer Sippin' Collection with new labels is back. Again, it's called Summer Sippin' Collection, and it has new labels, and it's coming back in these scents. Black Cherry Merlot. Coconut water, island margarita, peach bellini, pink apple punch, and then a new one. This is interesting, you guys. Salted pretzel milkshake. That could be really wrong or really right. I guess we'll see. Watermelon lemonade, of course. Oh, I always bring that back. Okay, but it's a staple for summer, fair enough. And it's the best in the candle, I think. Yeah. Hold on, I'm over in the candle, but it's the best in the candle. Well, actually, no, it's the best in the soap and then the candle. Okay. Um, so the same old, same old, same old. Pink Apple Punch was there last year, I think, was it? I think. Oh, yeah. But that's already packaged from, like, years ago. And then everything else is the same old, same old, same old. But I'm really excited to see what the salted pretzel milkshake. Like, so that could be either really bad or really good. I don't know. Hmm. If I remember to smell that, I'll let you guys know what I think about it. Because, you know, I don't do candles, so... But I might... If I remember to smell it in the store, I might. And tell you what I think about it in my first haul or whatever. Or during the SAS. I don't know. Okay. Next collection for candles. These are all going to be candles. Okay. Backyard Bliss. Again, new labels on these. Black Teak Wood. Blueberry Pie is new. That should be really good. You know, like anything bakery. Bonfire S'mores. Ooh. Heirloom Apple. Lakeside Sunset, oh sorry, Sunrise, so Lakeside Sunrise, and Wildflower Meadow. Hmm. New Boardwalk Collection, that's going to be a new collection with new labels. Um, you know what I mean, it's called New Boardwalk, okay. <laughs> okay, this collection. Beach Cabana, Beach Grass, Saltwater Taffy, that sounds really good. Suntan, that's been back before. Summer Boardwalk, okay. White Sands. So there are a lot of good options for you candle lovers out there. So enjoy for that. Um, by the way, anybody who's saying that they're not going to go ham, Tina Marie, you know you will. Don't even try it, girl. <laughs> I watched Tina Marie's video today. She was like, girl, I'm not going to go ham. And she's like, well, maybe I'll get one candle. Or maybe ten. I was like, girl, are you trying? She's like, oh, I'm only going to... Tina, you know you're going to be there every damn day. And Nicole. And me. And Joe. And Nacelle, all of us in the Canada community, well, in the Bath and Body Works community, are going to be in that Bath and Body Works. We're going to live there for the four weeks. Please. Why is anyone tripping? We are going to live in Bath and Body Works for four weeks. I'm going to live and breathe. There will be so many halls. This channel is going to be Bath and Body Works channel for four weeks. Okay, well, it is. <laughs> but this is, I mean, there's going to be so many freaking halls that I'm going to be so swimming in this up by the end of it, okay? So, anyone trying it by saying, girl, I'm not gonna go ham. Girl, you're gonna go ham because we're all gonna go ham. That's our job. Our job is to go ham, especially for SAS. Every month, but especially for SAS. This is our time to shine, so... Just go ham. If you, if you don't have room for it, just... Oh, I just knocked all these charters out. Okay. <laughs> if you don't have room for this stuff, just... Give everything you have away to start new. A mess! Ah, a mess! Okay. Now, now the last collection. It's called Sacred Geometry. I feel like I'm in math class. Um, Al Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. <laughs> Cacti 
Cactus Blossom, Georgia Peach, Lemon Mint Leaf, Midnight Blue Citrus, Pineapple Mango, Rose Water, and Ivy. So, let's look back. And that's it, you guys. Oh my god, I, I gave you so much tea. It was crazy. So hopefully you guys have sipped your tea because I, I served a lot of it. So I'll be back if anything else hits. Um, again, this is courtesy of Bath & Body Works Daily Finds. Tess, shout out to you, Gra. Um, and you can find her on her blog and also on Facebook and Instagram. Once again, Bath & Body Works Daily Finds. Um, but anyway, you guys. Thanks, Tess, for that information. Thank you for watching. And, um, yeah, now you know. You have your list ready. What are you going to get? What are you excited for? Let me know in the comments below. Are you going to go ham? Please. You're going to go ham, girl, because I'm going to go ham. And you're going to go ham, too. We're all going to go ham. So let's just pret stop pretending we're not going to go ham. And just go ham. Okay? Go ham. Pretend it's Thanksgiving and go ham. <laughs> In fact, pretend it's Thanksgiving dinner, and I don't want you to go ham. I want you to go ham, turkey, mashed potatoes, gravy, green beans, collard greens. I want you to go pumpkin pie, pecan pie, sweet potato pie. Girl, just go ham. Ham. Honey baked ham, okay? Yes. Okay. Gravy. Sweet potatoes. <laughs> Oh, okay, anyway, I think I'm good. Okay, a mess. I still got four other bits of film. This is gonna be a mess. Okay, you guys, so now that we've established that, I'm gonna go ham. There'll be hauls probably twice a week at least. Maybe more than that. Maybe three times a week. I don't even know. Honestly, I might even go every day. I don't even, I'll be honest. I'm probably gonna be in there more than I'm even, I'm probably gonna bring my sleeping bag and just sleep, sleep over right there in the bed. <laughs> I might even do my hauls from the damn store. Okay, how you doing? <laughs> like like Wendy Williams says, hey, da. a mess. No, hey, da. <laughs> oh my god, a mess. I swear, bath and body risk get you high. I swear to God, girl. But then again, I always act like I'm high because I'm a mess, girl. I always act high because I'm high on life. Okay, and a bath and body works. And Victoria's Secret. By the way, Victoria's Secret, their semi-annual sale starts for their beauty and their fragrance uh, Monday, June 3rd, in case you're wondering for that. And then I think Monday, June 10th is when their pink and clothing all that stuff starts. So, but call your head, call your store ahead of time to make sure. But I'm pretty sure that's last to you on that, girl. So, yeah. Mmm, yes, honey, yes. Shop, 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 shop. <laughs> oh, my God, you guys. I'm going to go ham, you guys. I'm going to go ham. Okay, guys. I wasted enough time. I've given you all the tea. So now it's time to go. If you, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. Comment. Gray bell. And all my other social media will be where? You're right. Down below. Where else? So, yeah. Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram. Like it. Follow me on there. Like, comment, subscribe. Gray bell. And I'll see you in my next video. Until next time. I don't want to be dramatic. Anyway, until next time. I was going to pause and say it, whatever. Anyway, until next time. Bye, guys.